when it comes to what we call signature reduction at Surefire, so really the two things that we're looking at the most are sound suppression and flash suppression. Those two things combined gives us our total signature reduction package. With the SOCOM series, we were able to get rid of the first round flash to where it's uh, similar or the same as the second round and beyond. We've specifically focused on reducing flash when we designed our suppressor, so it doesn't create a large flash signature causing the enemy to shoot back at you. Uh, we're comparing a Surefire SOCOM 5.56 RC2 mounted on SF3P flash hider to one of the competitors uh, flow through suppressors. I consider ours to have like a sushi pencil. It's like about broken off number two pencil worth of dull orange flame. And that's with M855, which is no flash retardant in the propellant. That 15 yards away, that flame's only there for a millisecond and it's dull orange anyway. It's not like a really bright, intense flame. And it doesn't increase as the suppressor gets hot. So tonight we're gonna to be doing the use of sock standard test, which is an eight mag uh, course of fire. Six of the mags being semi-auto, one of the mags being three to five round burst, and the final mag being a 30 round mag dump. What we've seen a lot of, and the suppressors that we've tested from our competitors, is that once they start to heat up, like one magazine into it, you get a lot more flash signature. Seen uh, quite a few of them that from the first round on forward have significant flash coming out the front of them. Also seen some that, yeah, if you're doing a five round test, like uh, a first round, a second round, a five round burst, then they'll look okay. But if you start doing any kind of hard firing with them, somewhere between the second and third mag of even semi-auto, you'll start getting two to three foot of flame out the front of them. All right, for tonight's test, we got Two rifles set up, almost identical. Uh, both of them have 10 and a half inch barrels and full auto Colt M4 lowers. I'm Barry Duke here with Cody Carroll. Appreciate you guys watching our video. And don't take our word for it, as Reagan used to say, trust but verify. Yeah, go out and get yourself an RC2 SOCOM and test it against any low back pressure suppressor on the market. Verify the results yourself.